Now, this is your territory, you know, like soul food. This is a story about a young black man, so um, it's beautiful. How did you find these actors? Well, this is interesting because in 2009, I looked in New York for, I feel like the movie wasn't going to work if I didn't have the right kids. So in 2009, I didn't find anyone. So we started the movie again in 2010. I looked in New York, looked in Chicago, and then we looked in LA. And um, Skyler was there in the audition. And you know what's interesting? He was there the same day Ethan was there. They didn't know each other. They were there the same day. They didn't even know each other. And immediately I put them in a chemistry test right away because I felt they were very good individually and it worked out. But then the movie didn't go that year. So we had to wait till 2011. And I thought they were going to be too big at that time. So, but they were the same height. They came in. And they came in on the same day again, you know? Which is great. And then they did a chemistry test and I said, okay, I'm going to get them in a room right away with Jordan. Because Jordan was came down to see us. I'm going to get them in right away. And our chemistry test was great. And I was like, these are the, these, this is the cast, these are the guys. So they were just great actors and they took their craft very seriously. I learned as a director that I can really talk to them like an adult. I didn't really have to change my vocabulary as a director with them. I could just go right to the subtext. They were there for the boot camp. They were there working with their coach. They were there, we were down uh, dealing with a lot of addiction programs. They talked to the kids in uh, Red Hook and met a lot of kids. So I like to thank their parents who were there for allowing me to have the time.